Hi everybody, welcome. Today we're making strawberry cheesecake bites. Now these are a delicious little dessert. It's very decadent. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna take a strawberry, we're gonna cut it in such a way that we are gonna pipe in the middle of it some cream cheese filling that is very reminiscent of cheesecake. And we're gonna to top it with a fresh blueberry. This dessert is delicious. You, you get a little healthy part to it with the strawberry and the blueberry, and you get that decadence with the, with the cheesecake filling. I tell you, it is amazing. It is beautiful and you are gonna love it. So I'm Rockin' Robin, and I'm gonna show you how to do it right after this. You're gonna love this recipe, guys. The ingredients are few and very simple. So let's go over those ingredients. We're gonna start off here with our blueberries. We have fresh blueberries here that I've already rinsed, some fresh strawberries, and I suggest that you use sort of a medium size. I mean, I know we have those really large strawberries, but I think it's a bit much. You wanna make these a little closer to bite size or maybe two bites. I have some vanilla extract, a little bit of softened butter, some cream cheese that is also softened. You want that to be nice and soft so we can mix it. And I have some powdered sugar. Now I made my own powdered sugar. And I just wanna mention that if you want to avoid GMOs, genetically modified organisms, you might wanna make your own by just placing your sugar into a blender or a food processor and just blending it up. It gets very fine and works perfect for or substitute as uh, powdered sugar. To prep our strawberries, all we need to do is slice off this end of the strawberry so that we have a nice flat bottom. So just gonna cut off enough just so that the strawberry will sit up straight like that. What we're gonna do is we're gonna just place an X into the strawberry. So we're gonna cut down, but don't cut through. Go down pretty far and you're gonna make an X. That should do it. And that's ready for filling. All we have left to do now is mix up our cream cheese filling. So I've got my softened cream cheese here. We're gonna place it right there in the bowl, along with a little bit of butter, and we're gonna cream those two together. Now I'm gonna add the vanilla extract. And we'll begin to add our powdered sugar, a few spoonfuls at a time, and obviously make this as sweet as you like it, guys, so you can adjust this. You're gonna need a piping bag for this to make it very easy to put into the strawberry. So either use a piping bag like I have here and I have it standing up in the glass to help me out, or you could use a Ziploc bag and just you know fill it up into a corner and then snip off one end and you can use that as a piping bag. We are going to fill the bag with our beautiful cheesecake filling. All right, so we're ready to rock and roll here. Just push down your, your filling, okay. So we are going to work this tip into the center of the strawberry, just like that. And now I'm gonna fill it up. So I'm gonna gently fill the rest of these up. So go ahead and pipe in it a little extra filling if you need it in certain spots. That's what I'm doing here, and we're just about ready to taste these. All right, guys, that's all there is to making our strawberry cheesecake little bites. They're perfect for, you know, 4th of July or any time, really. I mean, I would make these any time of year. I'm gonna go ahead and taste one. You guys are really gonna love these. They are delicious. Just like I said, you know, that fruit, nice and it's juicy, it's refreshing. And I tell you that cream cheese filling is to die for, really. You're eating something that you are just gonna really enjoy. All right, thanks for watching everybody. I really appreciate you guys. Uh, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. That way you won't miss any new videos coming out every week. And leave me a comment as always. Thanks again and we'll catch you in the next video with another delicious recipe.